He's hitting the stage to perform a classic hit. Be right back. We're Clay Aiken. This is Tasha from Oklahoma. Clay Aiken, when the view returns on ABC. Oh, Oklahoma, where the wind comes. Clay Aiken was here. He came out of the closet. He became a dad, and now he's about to hit the road with a fellow, excuse me, a fellow American Idol alum. Please welcome back Clay Aiken. I just want to start with this. You haven't been here. It's been two years because you were doing spam a lot when you yes, came here two years ago. Dance. We did the little dance. Yes. And a lot has happened since then. It's been busy. Uh, the first uh, thing, <laughs> you you came out. You came yeah. out and you came out and said that to you. To the were, public. To the public. To the public. Yes. yes. And you, Which we all should have to do at, really yourself. at some point. Yeah. Everyone, Everyone should have to do should it. Should come out eventually. That's yeah. straight day, whatever. I was going to say, I think coming out to yourself is kind of the, the, the first step and to your friends. I mean, it doesn't have to be. Every, everybody grows in their own time and everybody yeah. comes out right. public when they want to. Well, right. that's the question I have. It, it, was there a reason why you didn't do it during, when you were on American Idol versus well, now? Well, I probably didn't know then. I mean, I probably didn't quite realize then at the time um, what was going on. Um, and then, you know, there's a lot of stuff in the, in the, in the industry, in the media industry. There's pressure from, from different sides. And I think, you know, you have to learn to love yourself mm -hmm. first. And then when you do that, you're ready to... And how old were you on that show? You were young. I was, I was 24. You must, it must be very scary to be thrown into the public and the fear of, of people. You know, yeah, I mean, you don't know. How scary is this? This is scary. No, no, no. What about as scary as fatherhood? Because was it two years ago, you yeah. and James Foster, right? right? Your really good friend, mm -hmm. had a baby boy. Congratulations. How's he doing? He's doing well. He's, yeah. he's, He's a normal two-year-old, Parker. He's uh, he's walking well. He's running. He didn't walk, but maybe a day, and then he started running right away. Yeah. So uh, happy, he's happy keeping us. Father's Day. That I know. Advance, I just right? heard that the other day, and someone said, "Well, what are you doing for Father's Day?" And I was like, "Well, I guess I'll get." Oh, it's for me this time. Uh, <laughs> I don't have to. I, just, I don't nice. have to get anything. For this child with your best friend, right? Yeah, yeah. We, um, I we... really respect the fact that you did it that way. Well, you, well, you want to do it? Because I'll carry the yeah, baby. Let's go, baby. <laughs> I want you to have I that love you that much, Mary. I, 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 but you know what? <laughs> but I do respect that you did it that way. You know, you either adopt or you yeah. do it that way. I mean, doing the shaker with the two and the... Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, I don't want the shaker. <laughs> Congratulations on being a father. But now you're going on tour with yeah, Ruben with Stutter, and, and uh, he, you were the runner-up. Mm. Yes. <laughs> oh, I, 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 no, I'm sorry. I was. I was. I'm sorry. No, I was. You sold, I was. You sold a lot of records. I, I, but, but you know, it, it's funny because on American Idol, they had all of the folks from American Idol, the alum, they came back and celebrated Simon Cowell's final mm -hmm. um, uh, thing on there. And you, not only were not there, you said you don't even watch American I Idol. I haven't watched in the longest time. I have, I, when I watched the season after I was on, I got so nervous. My hands started sweating, and I get really nervous about the whole thing. So yeah. I hadn't watched it. I, my life was okay without it. And, I appreciate it, but I just, it makes me too anxious to watch that show. And I get too invested, and then I, you know, it depresses me that I didn't, I don't get to do it anymore, you know? Yeah. Uh, what about this, this album, Tried and True? Can you tell us a little bit about what we're going to hear? Because we've heard, like, pop style from you yeah, on the we, past we one. Look at the cover. Can we just see the cover? Yeah. I'll say it. Because he looks very slick on the cover. Hey, yeah. 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 Yes, I wanted to kind of make that, uh, make that vibe. So. And you're doing Unchained Melody. I'm told I am. that this has a very important meaning for you also. Well, you know, it's a song that I sang for years. My mom always told me that she wanted me to record it mm -hmm. and uh, go to Nashville and be a big star. And uh, then Leanne Rhymes did it, and I didn't get to. So well, this is we, my chance, hopefully. Well, we want you to do it here to perform yeah. Unchained Melody off his new CD, Tried and True, is Clay Aiken. <laughs>